Welcome back to the Cows channel. No one is making medical supplies. That's not good. That's really not good. Because we have no medical supplies, but we are starting to gain on the herbs. And we are also starting to gain on the plastic, too. Thank God. Okay, so building those things was right. And we have an engineer actually building the robotics facility right now. The names small, medium, large, and extra large, or very large, or whatnot, can be confusing. Because some places have start off on medium. But with your little scroll wheel, you can't, uh... You know, it looks like it's a small. Like, this is a... Like, this is a small. No, that's a medium. The f this is a small. Yeah. I mean, it's hard to tell sometimes. So, what I need to do right now... Uh... Not... Yeah, good. And almost done with the semiconductor to build the repair thing. That is excellent. Where the hell are you guys going? Taking ore to airlock. Why that way? Well, the... And we don't want to build anything... I can probably connect these. I cannot connect these things somehow. But I can connect this one. This is this one. I don't know why. So, no more of this hallway because it's not its not going to be able to handle air. Fortunately, the robotics facility, it does, it's never going to have more than like three or four people in it. It'll be okay. This is a main throwaway. It needs to be a little higher, but it'll be fine. And right now, our brave engineer, Ember again. Hi, Ember. She is making the last semiconductor we need. This will let our robots repair themselves naturally. That drill bot is going to go on forever looking over here as usual we are checking and we are seeing tons of bioplastic being produced not so much oil but that's probably because for some reason the oil was being carried all the way around not actually sure why uh, the medical bay can probably fit one more bed in it can it it can and that's it and then we can store the full meds we need to treat people here. So I like, I like that. That's a good medical bay. Okay, we're slowly ticking up on starch and medicine. And we are working on replacing the medicine that we lost during the great solar flare of... What the hell was it? Like day 15? Yeah, whatever. Okay. Spare parts are being used to maintain our know, wind turbines. And we have plenty of power, so... Well, right now I want to wait until this gets built. You don't want to queue up too many orders, but there we go. There we go, it's almost done. Bed was built, but we've ran out. We're not out of medical supplies, we're still out of medical supplies. Now we'll be able to handle anything that comes our way here in this colony. We won't have to worry about a thing. Oh, and there's the last. Ember herself is carrying the last semiconductor. Are you going to build it too? Are you going to build it too, Ember? Go going to check and see. No, you're not, actually. Some, someone will come build it. Probably Jensen. Oh, look at this. It's another medic and two more biologists. Ah, uh, there we go. There we go. Now our robots can come repair themselves automatically. That is awesome and in fact number one is going to come take advantage of this right now and it'll probably make him last a little longer on the integrity because I think if he goes all the way down it hurts his integrity so what it does is it makes them last longer but they're not permanent still now number one is a little almost at the end of his life expectancy which is not good so what that means is that we really do need to pump out more semiconductors so that we can build more robots. Alright, keep it working, keep it working, keep it working, keep it working. So what I'm going to do, I'm, I'm going to turn this room high priority. I want, four, I want four shifts of workers at all times in this room to keep up with the demand of our goods. Now, security. Yeah, and then airlock. Yes. Yes. 
and then we'll build an airlock. So that's another thing to... And thank God, because it looked like drill number two was already in need of service. But here he comes. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's not good. Uh, we're going to, after we build that and the airlock, we will work on uh, another battery, another solar panel. Don't worry, our little drill bot will kick one of those workers out just as soon as he can. Eventually, we will build our own fleet of drill bots. The drill bots, the drill bots. Dun, dun, dun. Good, we have a full workload of guys. Once you get two drill bots, what you want to do is you want to have another mine. Because the drill bots are going to produce so much that your workers aren't going to have anything to do. Okay, so there's two and there's... Okay, it's going to take a while to... It's going to take a while to haul the necessary resources over here. We are actually starting to pile up the starch, so it's a good thing I told them, Hey, I want shifts of workers on here at any given time. And actually, we're running low on metal somehow. How are we running low on metal? Oh, that's not good. We are draining the power very quickly. How about a little wind, huh? How about some solar power, you know what I'm saying? Uh, food production and starch production are good. Okay, wind's picking up. Wind is picking up. If the wind picks up just a little bit more, uh oh, but it's not, uh, it's picking up, but I don't know if it's picking up enough to, I don't think it's, well, it's starting to pick up a lot. Yeah, you know what, before I add the airlock, I'm going to have to, dang it, is it going down already? It is, we are screwed. We are very screwed. Okay, yeah, this is not good. Before we build anything else after this control center. It's gotta be... Power is really unreliable. In this game. You know, there's no way to, like, produce it quickly. So we're gonna slow it down because we're gonna have to... Once it hits low enough, I'm going to have to, unfortunately. Power's just so unreliable. I do love the ships. The ships are cool. And here he comes. Jensen's coming to build that. Uh, we have no power. Where the hell? Oh, you must have been fixing that. Okay, we need another battery. We need another solar panel. There's only one thing to do. I'm sorry. All non-vital structures must be turned off until morning. Okay, control center was built. Jensen's not going to run out of air, is he? What the fudge? Did you just trip? Nah, Jensen's got plenty of air. And with the thing right here, it'll be pumping air into the connection really quick. Okay. So, we need metal. Lots and lots of metal. I can't turn the power back on until morning. Because we're still only producing... Again, man, power is so unreliable in this game. It's it's actually frustrating, I'm going to be honest with you. Everything's decaying because I can't maintain it. So I'm just going to speed up until morning. Once the sun rises, it'll be fun. This is considered vital. Can you get solar flare at night so you have night power, I wonder? And I'm gonna have to, I don't wanna build anything here because I'm gonna have to delete at least this one when I'm ready to expand. Okay, so. 
while we're waiting for the solar panels to come online. That's five. We don't have five. Okay, I'm going to turn the power back on and hope it doesn't screw me. It is going to screw me because there is no wind again! Ah, Irritates the hell out of me. Power storage is low again. Come on, wind. Come on, wind. The colony is going to die. Come on, wind power. Plus, I need these guys to, like, fix everything now. So, come on, wind. Come on, wind. Pick it up. I mean, it's, I just need it to... It's still ticking up. I just need it to tick up faster and harder. Come on. There we go, we are slowly producing what we need. But is it enough? Probably not. Oh, positive power! Uh, equivalent power. Well, if it's still ticking up, why is it... How is it going down? Positive power! Okay, come on. Come on. I need, this is why sandstorms were good on that first planet. At least you got tons of uh, power. Yeah, we're going to have to build the most massive power structures we can. Meanwhile, our biologists are now working their butts off to try to uh, maintain the plants that we let not maintain. And the... Dang it, the meat went down too. All right, it'll be fine. It'll take a day or so, but it'll be okay. Okay, how much time's left in this day? Half the day. So we, if we have decent wind for half that, we have full wind. Okay, so we are generating lots of power. You need to be able to generate at least twice as much power as you use, I think. So I need another turbine and I need another solar panel. And I need you guys to work your butts off to do that. For instance, where, where the hell were you? Were you getting fixed again? Were you getting fixed again? You must have been. Yeah, I think they decay a lot slower with that. We're going to turn off Colony. I still get these guys, right? Yeah, I do. Okay. It's a worker. Oh, was it just one? I thought it was two. Okay, so we should have enough people to run this room and the mine at full capacity 24 7. There we go. That's filling up. That, that one's not going to get to fill up, unfortunately, but. Come on! How's our food? Our food was... Okay, our food is fine now. There we go. Dang, it's still missing three. And we don't have the ore to... Oh my god! Negative water. Oh, but it's okay because the grid, it's slowly. Can I get an engineer to extractor three, please? Can I get an engineer to uh, two? Excuse me. Can I get an engineer to extractor two? Thank you. 
Okay, so plastics no longer will be an issue. The issue is ore. I might have to build. Yeah, I have. I have to build another mine. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to build another mine. So that's next on the long list of stuff that we have to do to not die on this godforsaken dust. I mean, ice ball, excuse me. There you go. And, okay, power's back. Good. And back to full capacity in this. Really, one water tank is all you need. Oh my god, it is actually positive power at night. So that's good. Uh, way too much starch, which is not good, but uh, we'll work on it. That engineer has been at it for like half the, a third of the night. I'm having good trouble clicking on you. Good job, Gerard. Man, he actually... Ah, he didn't use up too much oxygen, so he's okay. So... What now? Well, everything's getting back on track. Uh, we're gonna be a little short on medicine up until we can... Okay, one more for here. We are still... We're not still building spare parts, unfortunately. We're not getting enough ore. Even with my drill... Where's my drill bot? My drill bot is hurt again? I need more drill bots, man. The drill bots. The drill bots. Do, 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 do. Hill makers are good. Power's good. Power's, power's still going up. I like that. Good. Up. Oh, power's about to start going down. Because the wind is dying down. Well, this might get scary. If you don't have anything useful, get the hell out of here. Freelance. Carry a bot? Okay, hang on. So... That's 95... And I want to sell the medicine because that's the amount I want to keep on stock. I will sell this. Carrier bot is 80. And some more. Okay. That's a lot of trading, but I think it's okay. And we are. And one piece of order just run the. The metal processors are just not being used. I don't. I have a drill bot and two workers at all times. I just, they're not getting capacity. Uh, he real. Oh, poor CR1's about to meet his life expectancy, but we're gonna get another one to replace him. It's okay. Uh, yeah, I think this should be fully stocked medical cabinet. Dude, you're thirsty as hell. Why? Why don't you have a drink? Because you're going to... Okay, you don't have sleep as a need, but you do have hydration. I don't understand you. So our little colony that can is chugging along. Okay, we have biologists. See, the thing is, I don't have... I don't have what I need. I'm gonna have to start selling bioplastic, which I finally have tons of. Okay, so there's two more of the food. Uh, they're maintaining this pee pad and this rice pad. Maintaining medicinal plants. Come on. 
All right, there's the last. Dang it! I did not realize our power was draining that quick. But there's the last. Then we'll build a solar panel. Then we'll build a large battery for them to charge. What do you lack? You lack. There's the last of the spare parts. Two more food. Okay, everything's here. That carrier bot's going to help improve our efficiency a ton. Or at least for a small amount of part time until the other carrier bot dies. But Okay, someone come build this. Someone come build this, please. And it's going to leave us with one or two, just because we need the metal. Somebody pick it up. Good job. Look at the number three. He's a gamer. He's already pulling his load. And here comes Jensen. Jensen is a boss, dude. And here he comes to build the turbine, which is going to help immensely. Meanwhile, solar panels are slowly coming on. Here we go. Here we go. Here we... Finish it up, Jensen. Yeah, and there's the connector. Ta-da! Alright, next up... Can I build the battery over here then, maybe? Oh, I can actually f squeeze it right here. Battery is found in me! Battery! Battery! See, I can get more colonists. But I don't have any place for them to work, and I don't have the resources for them to work either. Now, thankfully, we are churning out the bioplastic as much as possible. We're going to need a new canteen after we finish this uh, power situation. But for right now, positive power. Oh, this large wind turbine. Even at this speed, makes more than a lot of solo on this planet, which is fantastic. That is fan fantastic. And the drill bot comes out for more maintenance. I like it. There's another piece of ore. I dang it, they keep doubling it up there. Are we making? We're trying to make semiconductors, and we're trying to make spare parts. I'm going to have to stop selling the spare parts for a while because I'm going to need them for the short term. I can still sell medicine. I can still sell bioplastic. Just to build out this stuff, we need metal. I need metal. That's what I need. Uh, excuse me. Come on, churn it out. There you go, and you're in here now, and both of you guys. Are... Can we get some starch in here? I have plenty of workers not doing anything. What the hell is Luke doing? Luke, are you playing in the snow? Is that a thing? Yeah, we are a little more on capacity. I don't want to add capacity until I've finished building out my infrastructure to support. It is dark as hell now in my room because it's winter and I'm an idiot not paying attention when I stop these recordings. Uh, we have four meals and we're slowly ticking back up on the food, so that's good. Yes, eat to your heart's content. What do we got in here? We got pasta. Oh man. You guys are so freaking lucky. Here we got a basic meal. Over here, what do we got? We got another basic meal. We got burgers. You guys got burgers? Oh man, Outpost K49 is the best place ever. Obviously. And good more ore. 
If I can get afford another drill bot or two, this would go great. And working on all the ore. Working on all the plastic. That's ready. That requires three more. Dang it. So that piece of ore will be what finishes it off most likely. And then I'm going to have to wait until I tick back up to five metal because it's slowing down production of spare parts and we've only got two left. So we're going to have to wait until... We'll wait until we tick up to spare parts again until we start getting positive spare parts. Medical supplies we can trade. Plastic we can trade. Those are going to be our trade goods for the near future. Since I'm not putting anything here, I might be able to put the next canteen here. And just connect both of these things to here. Time acceleration, go! Uh, negative power, not great. Well, positive power, negative power, positive power. Ah, I can't keep up. Still making all the meals that we need. Okay, this should be... Two, three... This should be the last bit of metal that we need. I'm waiting on the last bit of metal that we need. And then I'm going to build another mine because I have a fully stocked... Uh... Yeah, before we build the large solar collector, I have a fully stocked... Oh, dang it, I can't build anything that requires metal. Food traders. Nope, don't need it. See ya. Man, they. Oh, no, he is okay. We are completely out of spare parts. That is bad. Yep. And so I'm going to have to wait until it ticks back up to five. So while I wait for that, I'm going to turn this recording off. And the cow will see you guys next episode when he finally has enough spare parts to do stuff with again.